Hello everybody, we are back on commentary and ready to continue commentating as of what's going on for this next set with John and Utopia. What's good everybody? Stop the battle. Hey, introduce yourself, man. Oh, hello. Uh, I go by Persona. Uh, I do cas casual uh, commentating in my university back in, uh, in That's my university actually, One, which is pretty cool. Go. If any of you guys are watching, oh, what's up? <laughs> Say hello to the people, man. Alright, so here we go. PS2, game two. And with your second rate up one, I'm surprised, because usually these two can bomb back and forth as far as I know. I'm still kind of fresh to the New York scene when it comes to Smash, but in terms of characters or players, anyways, like Utopian and John, I always see them go back and forth at waypoint, at bombs. They're constantly at each other's throats in terms of rivalry. Oh, alright, so like natural rivals, I would say. Yeah, I would say, like, at least just in terms of sets, or at least just like in a body count. Like, they're both, they both make their characters look dumb. All his feet once, but in a good way. Look at how deep he's reaching My for that. Goodness. And oh. that was a beautiful movement option from John, just swerving to the left right there. I didn't think he had to make it back. <laughs> yeah, no, I was a sound. With the can do that, apparently. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, oh uh, Lord. Down okay. tilt. Almost, almost like getting me close. Oh, and the spike. Oh, you tried to breathe? You thought you could breathe? <laughs> The leg says otherwise. Uh, both times I'm out here, I just see legs putting in work. CSS, Palatine is all the same white foods. All the white foods got the legs, bro. Okay, yo. My goodness. Can we talk about how all the white foods are top tier this time around? That's why this is the best fast game, bro. Yeah, exactly. Easily. <laughs> Sash 4 was DJ because Palo wasn't anything at all in that game, unfortunately. Yeah, absolutely not. Oh my lord. Hey, so this is still... Oh, actually, just realizing it. Nah, this is not even at all. Never mind, Utopian's on the warpath right now against John. My goodness. And this time, at least, John got to breathe for a bit. Unless he knows your get-ups. In that case, he just yanked him back on the stage angelically with her divine punishment. Yeah, but in that scenario, you, like, you don't really know what it is that they're planning. It's, it's super scary. Truly, truly. And when we finish, especially there's so many what makes sense you can do with movement. You can delay with soccer ball. You can change how you're landing with your neutral beat because it changes how you land. And like, like the speed is what you fall in that set. Yeah. Put technology on my end. Oh, she can't do anything. Oh, that's fine. Never mind. What? What's one leg to two legs, right? Exactly. Right? Exactly. Holy crap. Get the boots, the heels, I might say. Breathe in. Just as we would say, just breathe in. Relax. Return to your original place. Oh, raw back air from a down throw. That true? Um, I believe with DI away, it should be. But with DI in, I think the option from there would be up air. That or maybe near this faster? I'm also not sure in terms of we fit with frame data. Chat, please don't sue me, but I definitely can say that that was the right option to go for out of that grab. Oh, oh the, the schmixing. This is the footies. Blank. As well. Just, so just, just left, right, left, right. Praise the sun. Praise him, my lord. Okay, give him the hands. Oh, More nice. hands. More hands. I still keep forgetting that forward air can actually spike from the bottom. Like oh on the my foot. god. Yo, if you if numbers actually manages to pull that off, that would be so high. Indeed it would be. And again, like I love John. He's trying to make himself well with projectiles. He's really giving him all these footsies. He's making him really think about when he's gonna approach and when he's gonna fully commit to running away. 
But at the same time, though, John isn't doing great in terms of neutrals because he's constantly ping ponging to a ledge and back off stage. But now he's finally got it onto an even stock count, so he's getting better with it. He got the recovery from the neutral beat. He got the breathing. He can breathe. My man can exhale and inhale. He can produce carbon dioxide Natural from the oxygen. Natural counter stress. Exactly. Exactly. He breathing is OP, man. <laughs> Got finals coming up now. Deep breathe, man. Bro, why can't we all just breathe? Like, when you breathe and you kill your opponent in three hits, like that's weeping in a nutshell. <laughs> yeah. Why? Why doesn't? Why don't anyone learn from her, man? Just breathe. <sighs> oh wow! In that and combo. out. In and out. And speaking of in and out, this is this game is almost in and out right now. With it being Ooh. super even, but great drift back for John, avoiding that explosive flame. And oh, again, he's so, so cool smooth. to drift. It's so. Unexpected. I've never seen that from a Weefit before. And he's burst off from ledge with the soccer ball and how she angles it. It's a really good way to mix up Utopian, and we could see game three easily. Though, at the same oh, time, wow. though, I don't think Utopian wants a game three with how deep he's going against him when he's trying to recover. My lord! I feel like any more, it might start getting to Utopian. Oh lord. Okay, so more breathing. Oh lord, he's not gonna get the kill quite yet. Because not enough hits done on that down throw quite yet. And he tried Forward to cover tail. the roll, but the back air was a bit oh, too late. Okay, that's the punish. Ba oh, oh, no. He fumbled it. But he has some healing off at least. It's going to live for a bit longer. Pass up. No. Oh, it there. should poke. Okay, so. The, yeah, as you can see, the shield wasn't covering her legs. So that was the one time where the legs weren't actually helping. Yeah, that was the one time where the legs didn't come through on that. That's the, that, those legs cost him the game and ran into a reset for game three. Yo, buff the legs, my guy. Buff the legs. Buff the legs. Buy save lives, bro. Grandson of Nick C. G doing God's work, I see. What's good? Beautiful. <laughs> all right, all right. All right, here we go. Oh, back to PS2. PS2. All right, all right. You say anybody has an advantage here, or is it just the neutral of neutrals? Hmm. I can definitely. S well, it's always weird. I have no idea why everyone loves the stage so much, but I always default to it. But it's not a bad stage. Can't lie about that. It works for most characters. Hell, it works for Kirby, even though he has a weird problem with platforms with his forward throw. For those who don't know, and he is calling out these spot dodges oh and air goodness. dodges super well, and going super deep yet again. Wow. Very demanding so far from Utopian, but oh, nice at the nice same time though, it's still pretty even. Right after that grab, he got like 20, almost 30%, but still pretty even in terms of spacing and percent. And he's, he's not telling his downsides correctly, unfortunately. And like right there, I'm not sure why he just let him hang on ledge like that. He was in, he was vulnerable, but he reset. The, the, two, the two of them respect each other very very well. Oh, like, of course. Like I said before, they're constantly playing with each other, so it makes sense why they kind of like, wait to see, like, what is he going to do? What is he going to do? I could punish him for re-grabbing the ledge twice, but he's going to do something else. He's going to think of a different counterplay than my counterplay. And it's like, like ping pong back and forth. This is my game. It's back to back to back to back. Well, up throw. I'm surprised at how little knockback that has. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, wow, I defend, like... Oh, this already wears quarters. I just realized. Fast already, huh? We had like 80 plus entries today, too. We're moving today in bracket. Shout out to all our local TOs. Give them some, give them some love. Oh, and speaking of love, another foot to the face will give her some love into the blast zone. Beautiful. I'm there. Oh, yeah. Okay, great air dodge down as well. Spot falling it. Okay, here come the nair loops. Minimal damage. Minimal damage. Only 22%. Good on John to air dodge away. Smart, smart. Oh, I thought you got lunch on that. I guess not. Oh my oh, goodness. Oh, the ping pong with the soccer ball. <laughs> In case anybody doesn't know, that Again. attack has a shield effect Dude. that just blocks any incoming attack. But the same thing really happened twice. What just seriously? And that lights up like almost forty percent. And you, there you go. There you go. I hope you're happy now because you just got what you wanted. Yo, there John, you go. Thank you so much. Man. It took you one game extra to wait for it, but you got it. You got the foot. Yo, you got he, the he foot. Gives, he gives what the people want. So, like, in technicality, she spiked him with three feet in the set so far. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. And he's I mean, soccer ball Huh? Is one, is one foot against three feet for spiking so far? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. And even though John has a high, higher percent, this is definitely still an even game, I would say. Okay, then there's the shield poke, unfortunately for John, but... We can still easily bring this back. 
Vo, deeper than that last flush, longer. Oh, but he caught him. He caught him perfectly. Oh, and he oh, almost caught the air dodge for it. Almost. I love how Utopian Rate is super responsive to any sort of ledge get up or ledge option that John tries to do to avoid any sort of punishment. He just reacts super fast. You should get up, grab, roll, go follow that with a dash attack or something else. It's perfect. Oh, but speaking of dash attack, that just oh, whipped nice. barely. Barely whipped. Yeah, John is shaking his head. I don't blame him. I don't blame him at all. Uh, absolutely. It's, it's basically Paladin dash attack, but without a shield. Just. The pose! The pose, bro! The pose! It's not gonna reflect anything! It's not gonna help you at all! Nah, man! Where, where's the shield in that? Buff Weepin! Give her a shield, man! Yeah, give, give, give Weepin a deep breathing shield! <laughs> no, 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 no! Make a, make a crossover with Ring Fit Adventure! And oh, like, yes! Yeah, yeah, yeah! No, make that an Echo Fighter for Weepin! Nintendo, do what you want! Yo, yo! Honestly, bet Nintendo! Stop right! We're looking at you right now! He wants to get fit, then put her in the game. Twice the fit, twice the energy burn. Exactly. Twice the deep breathing. Can we talk about the fact that like they they did not even use refit at all for refit? Wait, like, what do you mean? Like refit adventure? They could have just oh. as easily just put refit in, in that entire yeah. thing. Yeah. No, they just but made they it for like, refit. Hey, let's just have two fitness IPs. Cause why not? We didn't know we could get away with that. Yeah. And they did. <laughs> and it worked. Yeah. I'm still waiting to try that out. I had to work on a video for that soon. Might stream it later, but it, it looks really fun. Yeah. You know, people are trying to speak on that. So, <laughs> it's, a, it's a good way to promote exercise. This is what Nintendo planned this whole time. Speaking of exercising, he's really putting John numbers to the works. All of them there. Deep, super freaking deep. The scary thing about going deep on PS2, like below the stage, is that it's actually like. It's weird, like, it's a flat surface. It's not curved, like, what it looks like. It's not rounded in any, like, a trapezoid. So it's like. Like a rectangle, so to speak. So you, if you don't recover properly, then you get trapped underneath. So then, like, you just get snuffed out by the same itself. It's like going under a battlefield on the left side, where it's just like a rectangle. It's yeah. not curved. It, it's just like you get stopped flat on the left side. So you just go up, but you don't angle into the stage. You just go up and nowhere up. Yeah. Not to mention, there's also walls in the middle of it as well. So you can just wall jump and do some tricky maneuvers using that as well. Mm. Which is very good for a lot of people with wall jumps. Oh, rollback wasn't smart on that because the Nair covered so many options. Hell, like, if he just held shield, like that oh, would have put the fade back. Oh, Nair. Another Nair. An explosive oh, flame goodness. is brilliantly air dodged. Perfect how, how timing. No. I oh. mean, like, you're, okay, this is getting scary. Yeah, Devin no. in the back's getting freaked out. Mil yeah, Terry's getting mil freaked out too. <laughs> like everyone's freaking out right now. This is like one or two moves away from being the end. Dude! Oh! <laughs> oh! Dude! That jab was so smart. Oh, it just conditioned him so to do an option. Yo, and he oh. really just charged neutral be right in his face. And he really just spawned us to grab in time. Yo, and he forwarded him, him, clapped him, he clapped him, and what's the option here? What? More what? what Dude! Okay! This is so intense! Devin's screaming in the back! Come on. He's gonna pose with the back row! Bit of a pummel damage! Oh, He's gonna get that breathing. deep breathing in! Devin's still screaming! I oh, still will tail. take it! Oh my goodness! John really brought it back. What Yo, a those guy. are one of the most heart stopping oh, matches in Smash history. That was a oh, fun set. Oh my goodness. Very fun set to watch. Good stuff on John and the Utopian. Really great set from both really intelligent players. Very fun indeed. Wow. Oh, I am speechless. Cyberman is dying. The chat is dying. I'm here dying. I need a cop drop. Actually, <laughs> yeah, nah, I'm sorry. I, I spite these days. I don't even help. But that was a fun <laughs> set. I had a great time watching it. Yeah, no, this that was honest. That was so beautiful. Yo, yo Jerry, how'd you like that set? Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. You heard it here first, guys. Amazing. Amazing.